Um, my name's Chris Buckridge. I'm a member of the IGF uh, MAG, Multi-Stakeholder Advisory Group, um, and I've been working in the internet technical community for about 20 years now. And so as a MAG member, one of the areas of focus is on how do we get all of the different voices and different stakeholders into the IGF discussions and speaking in panels, attending the, the meeting, proposing workshops, all parts of participation. Um, and the IGF is really focused on formal stakeholder groups. You've got government, private sector, civil society, and the technical community. But within each of those stakeholder groups, you also have a diverse range of participants. And I think one of the big challenges is often to get the younger people in those stakeholder groups to engage. And there are lots of reasons for that. <coughs> I think if you're starting out in your career or you're even not working yet, it can be hard to get to a meeting. Um, you don't necessarily have the contacts or connections, um, so you don't know what's going on. Um, and so there are, uh, I think, a lot of ways we're trying to make sure that we can reach out. We can let young people know what their opportunities are. We can work with them to build proposals for workshops or to let them know that there are opportunities for them to speak in workshops and main sessions and open forums and all of the different sessions that we have here at the IGF. Um, and I think that's really important because, well, I mean, youth are the future. Obviously, they have a lot. Uh, they're going to have to deal with the outcomes of whatever governance decisions happen, not at the IGF, but in, in their governments or in international organizations. Um, I think they also probably have quite a different relationship to digital technologies and communication technologies than some of their older peers. So, I mean, myself, for instance, when I was very young, there was no internet. It was sort of just starting to be something when I was in school and then um, obviously I learned. But that's very different from children today or even children 10 years ago who had the internet as a presence in their life from the very beginning. And so they react differently, they understand differently how to um, use the internet, how to work on the internet, how to rely on the internet. Um, so it's a, it's a bit of a different perspective and that's a really important perspective to have in these discussions. Um, I think the role of youth in internet governance is changing in terms of there are more opportunities. We're seeing youth IGF events spring up um, around the world and so those are really useful in bringing young people together, in connecting those young people to other parts of the internet governance ecosystem and to making the connection to schools, universities, sort of other uh, venues where you have young people. Um, so building that kind of infrastructure to help young people engage is really important and that's starting to happen. There's a lot of really good examples of it already, but I think we'll see more of that happen in the coming years. So I'm really looking forward to that. Thank you.